While I can handle many living situations to be out in nature, 90% of the reason I chose a van was for the kitchen. Finding beautiful places to cook in the outdoors has become one of my favorite pastimes. But let's be real, if you're going hard in the outdoor exploration, you'll be going well beyond pavement and dirt roads, playing on trail all day, where it's handy to have a packed meal for your adventure. These ideas will keep you fueled while you roam the forests, mountains, and sea, nourished by plant goodness while still getting the bulk and protein you need. I'm going to start us off with some quick ideas before throwing a simple spin on the classic pack lunch, sharing my arsenal of vegetarian sandwiches that taste great even after a rugged day in the backpack. I'm saving the best for last, so stick with me to the end here, which includes a bonus breakfast. I invite you to experiment with these meals like frameworks, so let's get you feeling creative and inspired with a few quick ideas. The possibilities are endless with some pita, hummus, and any variety of veggies and proteins. Easily packed away for the trail without getting too soggy. They can be enjoyed as a vessel for all that goodness or all together in a snacking platter. Spring rolls are my favorite fresh option for warm summer days by the water. So convenient to pack away for your adventure. I have made many videos sharing the art of the spring roll, so please binge in my food videos for further guidance. You can incorporate such a variety of veggies and as much protein as your outing demands. Anything from peanut sauce to tofu. Yet another way to use a variety of fresh or cooked veggies are sushi tacos. My favorite only calls for a container of cold rice, soy sauce, and cooked sweet potato. Loaded into a piece of nori with hard boiled egg or hummus, tofu, the possibilities are endless. Even the standard taco can be enjoyed cold. Refried beans and white potato create a texture of potato salad, where he has a black bean, corn, and sweet potato medley make a fresh combo. I've even filled taco shells or tortillas with salads for the trail, helping make this fresh meal perfectly handheld. Salads alone are not to be underestimated. They can be bulked up into a satisfying meal for all that elevation gain. I always bulk up my greens with a grain such as quinoa or pasta noodles and a protein like beans, lentils, or a hard boiled egg. When packing your salad, always be sure to layer your salad with wet ingredients towards the bottom and greens at the top to prevent sogginess. Wait until you're ready to eat to give her a quick shake and always add your dressing last. This really hits the spot on warm summer days served in a jar or Tupperware. If your salad is more simple, it's a good idea to pair it with a filling trail snack like popcorn, which goes well with one of my first sandwich frameworks. Don't you dare even think about dissing the peanut butter sandwich. Sometimes simplicity is key. It can be such a wholesome treat on the trail and endures much abuse in a full pack. My go-to is a peanut butter banana with honey and cinnamon. It's quite filling, delicious, and gives your body much more calories than the standard PB&J, which can be upgraded with homemade jam like this one I made from foraged blackberries and chia seeds. Still, a little bit of fruit will always make it more of a meal. Now, for one of my favorite sandwiches you have to try this summer with locally grown produce. A fresh tomato sammy is a refreshing treat for long creek days. My favorite combo involves mayo, fresh minced garlic, homemade pickles, and fresh local tomatoes. The sunny creeks and farm stands of Vermont sparked this perfect means of packing this sandwich without sogginess. I pack pickled veggies, toasted bread, a whole tomato, mayo, and a knife. It's fun to have a little culinary play outside, creating a momentary kitchen in the great outdoors. Assembling this sandwich fresh is worth the extra work and ensures a satisfying lunch on hot sunny days. It's always a good idea to bring a knife on trail both for savory satisfaction and survival situations. Start with toasted bread of choice alongside optional greens or sliced cabbage for crunch. Tomatoes make excellent knives for spreading condiments without dirtying your knife. These tomatoes are really elevated with some fresh cracked salt and pepper, but it's not necessary. I add my pickles last as they can get soggy quickly, but they bring so much flavor that they're worth the trouble. This isn't very protein rich, so for those active days, you can hit it with sliced tempeh, hummus, or a fried egg. Honestly, I love a cold fried egg sandwich on the trail. It may not be for everyone, but it's one of my favorites, even with just some greens. Perhaps some sun-dried tomatoes or pesto. You can have a tangier flavor with homemade pickles or fresh veggies. 
Eventually, I started doing more intense hikes, so I knew I had to step up my protein intake. If you're looking for a strictly vegan protein option, look no further than this chickpea salad sandwich. Not only easy to bring along and assemble on the trail, but also so versatile with a vast variety of veggies and condiments. Smashing the chickpeas creates the texture of tuna salad without all the mercury. I find a jar is an easy, minimal kitchen tool to use. You can get creative with any variety of chicken or tuna salad preparations. Mayo is a good base, but I've done vegan yogurt and lemon juice in a pinch. I've also added a variety of sauces like mustard or buffalo sauce for extra flavor. Don't be afraid to keep it simple or get creative with any of your favorite spices, veggies, or flavors. This is a blank canvas kind of meal. My absolute favorite preparation involves some chopped sunchokes for crunch and kimchi for tanginess, always with a big handful of greens or sliced cabbage. With this clean, protein-rich alternative, you may never want chicken or tuna salad again. This next sandwich is my favorite of all time and involves yet another of my most loved vegan delicacies. Sautéing these oyster mushrooms until crispy and tender, seasoned only with smoked salt and soy sauce, creates a flavor and texture that goes beyond bacon. This makes an excellent pair with a variety of spreads from pesto to avocado to hummus. Paired with some plant-based cream cheese and greens, this Sammy has me in heaven every time. Wonderful warm or saved for the trail. I try to reuse food packaging as much as possible. You can add some kimchi right before eating for an Asian style spin on this treat. On a bagel, it's my favorite breakfast in the whole world. But when we don't have time for all that, this bonus breakfast will help any granola girl stay fueled. It's not all about lunch. Sometimes we hit the trail early and need a breakfast that's easy to throw together in the dark. This goes beyond your average bowl of cereal. For those days I want to get outdoors fast, I pre-pack my bag with some granola and a variety of fruits. This works standalone, perhaps with some nut butter, honey, and cinnamon for a flavor like baklava. We can really treat ourselves with a thermos of our favorite milk. Improve the nutritional content by adding more protein in the form of nuts or seeds, of which hemp seeds can add 10 grams of protein to this simple meal. Overnight oats are another great variation, simply adding equal parts water or milk to oats for an hour to overnight, using any and all of the same toppings, including another splash of your favorite milk. Thank you so much for joining me for more nourishing fun in my little kitchen on wheels. I'm always incredibly honored to contribute to the wellness of others, and if you'd like to support that mission, you can visit my Patreon for all the written recipe frameworks, or support me through my art shop. Just your love in the form of views, likes, and comments goes a long way in helping your girl share these insights to a more natural lifestyle. Please let me know what you'd like to see next in the comment section below. Until next time.